Go now. Come <laughs> on. 
careful not to get spotted. was right. I found a part of the steely, along with another piece of armor. There must be a piece of armor with each missing steely. But why? This section here refers to a ritual. 
It doesn't explain why the armor was separated and hidden with a steely piece. Uh, maybe that was part of the ritual? We need to find the other steely pieces. Are you ready? If we found these, then we'll find the other steely pieces too. I'll go look. Even with the full keystone in place, some of the meaning may be lost on us. I have faith in you. Oh! You won't believe what this section says. Of the primordial gods. Primordial. That's interesting. That's ancient. It could just be a prayer on behalf of the warrior. That's what I thought too, until I read this part. There's more? It mentions that the ritual will be activated. What ritual? I have no idea. I'm presuming it means we need all of the steelies in place before something happens. Do you have the location for the missing piece? This text is hard to make sense of. It appears to be a warning. Be careful when you explore the tomb of Orion. I'll be careful. Time to go. Is that Cassandra of Aiad, the Eagle Bearer, messenger of Zeus, she who launched a thousand hearts? Elkibiades. I'm known by many names, but that last one sounds to be of your own making. My young friend Orchimethes here could use your legendary talents to woo the object of his desire. You would have my eternal gratitude. I'd like to know more about the man asking for my help. I'm Orchimedes. I came to Alcibiades because he boasts of his exploits as a lover and knows Braxila. I'm a Mystheos, not some famed lover. Nonsense. She proved her strength, dexterity, and endurance when she got Roxana on her back. What's the job? Have you ever heard of Braxila? The name sounds familiar. Who is she? Who is she? A poet blessed by Apollo himself. She describes the gods as if they were her lovers. Her lyre is a legendary weapon wielded in her hands. I want to meet her, but talking to a goddess such as she? Terrifying. Oh, nonsense. Usually you give a woman some flowers, and she'll show you her flower. However, this is Praxila. She is not easily impressed. Of course. No ordinary flower will do. They need to be worthy of a goddess. I come to this coast every year for the poetry festival. Of all the beautiful blossoms, none match the scent and radiance of the coral rose. Fetch some, and all doors and legs shall open for you. I'll return with your flowers. Where can I find the coral rose? It sounds rare. Mm, you would
would be correct. However, like all good things in life, these take more work than most are willing to expend. They're atop a nearby mountain. Say I do get these flowers. Where would I bring them? Back to camp? Braxilla should be in her tent. You mentioned being here for a poetry festival? I did. It's one of the many festivals to Apollo. But this one holds a special place in my heart. Among other places. Other festivals are so stuffy. Here we worship like maenads. I've heard enough. Please, if you are as skilled with sword and heart as Alcibiades says, you'll return to me with the coral rose. As a poet, it's best that I stay at camp while you do the hiking. You'd be an easy snack for wolves or bears. I'll return with the roses. I'll kill you and make my cousin die! <sighs> oh. the coral roses. I found your coral roses. You're back! That... that's perfect. The roses are perfect. Oh, look at the luster. The fragrance. Now, you must deliver them to her. You came all this way to meet her. You should be the one to do it. Please, I'm much too nervous to speak to her. I've composed a poem to recite. Here, let me teach you. I'd say it all wrong. I'm a mystios, not a poet. Then, would you at least deliver the flowers while I rehearse? Fine. But the rest is up to you. Okay. She's at her tent. It's right there. Go give them to her.
Praxila, I have flowers for you from Orchimedes of... somewhere. Did I not tell you to get the wine five minutes ago? <gasps> Cassandra Vaillard, may I introduce you to my dear friend Praxila, Apollo's muse and mistress of the Golden Strings. Your Praxila? Didn't expect an aged bard, mercenary of Ayat? People your age tend to have more wealth, so if anything, this is better for me. Praxila, this is Cassandra Vaillard, eagle bearer, messenger of Zeus, launcher of a thousand. Cassandra Kaka, cast stone and light alike, leaves ladies and lads a light alive. Ailing women and awestruck men cling to her side. Ah, a true genius. Look at those shoulders. A soldier, a Spartan, a thorn in the side of tyrants. She who dares challenge Poseidon. Alcibiades, this one I'm keeping my eyes on. The poems she writes about me are never so kind. I have flowers for you. They're not from me. They're from uh, Orchimedes. He's right over... Well, he was over there. A coral rose? <laughs> I'll have to get my servant to add this to the pile. I also prefer actions to easy gestures. Where is that servant girl? I swear her head must be rattling with rocks. Mm, I wish she'd rattle my rocks. A haikos is missing. That idiot must have taken it with her and run off. A haikos? A haikos is Praxilla's legendary liar. I set it down after tuning moments before you arrived. I can't go on stage without a high cost. I did see Orchimedes leaving in quite a hurry. We need to get that liar back. Please, without Praxila getting everyone's juices flowing, this festival is just a bunch of young men measuring the size of their verse. This liar was special. Can you play another for your recital? Perseus without winged sandals or a mirrored shield was just a man. Would he have the same legends, the same mystery, if he performed each task without a legendary weapon? It's very valuable, both in significance and in drachmi. Orchimedes and the missing servant both disappeared as the lyre was stolen. They could be working together. Oh, and he seemed like such a nice boy. Alcibiades invited the viper into my tent. Is there somewhere they could have taken it? It's a poetry festival. There is no better hub for shady trade. I'll find the thief and return the liar. Praxila's liar has gone missing. Have you seen it? Praxila's liar is missing? That's terrible news. First, no every pedis, and now this? Krefsis really has gone to the dogs. I'm looking for a missing liar. Aren't we all? Are we? Have you found my liar? I'll find the thief and return the liar. <laughs> I'm looking for a man named Archimedes. I know an Archimedes. Otherwise, no. He might have been holding a liar? There are as many men holding leaves here, as there are blades of grass on a field. Do you know a man named Orchimedes? Orchimedes... 
Orchimedes. That's the kid who hangs out around the Vipers. Yeah, I know him. He's been coming to the festival for three or four years, maybe. The Vipers? Who are they? You know how it is. People feel small, so they band together to make the rest of us feel smaller. They took over the temple of Athena Etonia a while back. Now it's hard to take the road without being held at knife point. Do you think that's where Orchimedes would take a liar? <sighs> Hope not. For his sake. The Vipers are dangerous. If he did have the liar on him, they'd probably rough him up for it. <sighs> He's one of those kids that'd be keeping around for fodder, if you get me. Did he have a liar on him? I didn't see him with one. I saw him talking to you, then walking towards Praxila's tent. He and Praxila's pretty elot have been sneaking around lots. Just assume they were, you know, planting a garden. Is the Temple of Athena the best place to sell a stolen liar? You can buy and sell anything here, unfortunately. But going to the Vipers guarantees the person you stole from won't follow you in. Shame. It was such a beautiful temple. Thank you for your help. Hope you find the Lyra. Watch out for the Vipers at the Temple of Athena Etonia.